So the problem is that my keyboard, the physical keyboard, is from the United States. But my input language is from the United Kingdom. So when I try to find a symbol on my US keyboard, I can't find it. It doesn't match because my input language is set to United Kingdom. So in this video, I will show you how to add another language to your Windows so that you could match your keyboard from whichever country it is to the language that your Windows recognizes. In this way, also you would be able to switch between various different languages by using Microsoft Language Bar. So let's get started. The first step is go to the start, right click and then select settings. In here you need to select time and language. Then you need to click on language on the left here. Here you can see my Windows display language is English United Kingdom and here it gives me the list of all the languages I've got and I've got only English United Kingdom. All I can do now is to click add a language. It comes with a list of different languages so type the name of the language you're interested in. So if you type English it comes with a lot of different versions of English so I'm interested in English United States. I select it and then I click on next. As you can see it has almost all the features that you could have in a Windows 10 application. If you want to when installing it set it as your Windows display language just check here and it will automatically do that as well. Another nice feature is that when you write using your pen it can recognize your typing and convert it into type words. Once you're happy with the selections just click on install. You can see here it's installing now. So after the installation is complete Windows says you have to sign out and sign back in for the changes to take place. So you have closed all your application that you have left open and saved everything then click on yes sign out now or you can do that later by clicking no sign out later. So after you sign back in you can see here we got a new symbol called ENG which means English the language and you can click on it and then change from for example English United Kingdom to English United States. And the shortcut key to do that automatically is to hold Windows and press spacebar. And now my symbols exactly match what's there on my keyboard and I would not have any issues trying to figure out what is where. I hope this video was useful. If it was, please don't forget to watch my other videos on my left and to subscribe to support my channel. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye-bye.